Android mobile apps and games are now available for you to install on Windows 11 using the preview of the Amazon App Store, which you can get by installing their app from the Microsoft Store. Having tested it out for nearly a month, I'll give you my thoughts to let you know if it's any good. At the time of this recording, the Amazon App Store is only available to customers here in the United States, with a rollout outside the U.S. expected at a later date. Prior to installing the Amazon App Store, it's important to check out the system requirements, which are absurdly high just to run mobile apps. You must have at least 8GB of RAM. It requires that you have a solid state drive, so if your primary drive is a hard disk drive, don't even bother. The processor minimum requirements are stringent as well. You should have at least an Intel Core i3 8th generation, AMD Ryzen 3000, Qualcomm Snapdragon 8C or above. So basically a modern processor no older than 5 years. In addition, you must have virtualization enabled in the BIOS on your computer to use it. A quick way to find out if virtualization is already enabled is to right click your start menu and select Task Manager. Go to the Performance tab here at the top and look for Virtualization. If it says enabled, you're good to go. If it's not enabled, I'll put a link in the description with the instructions to enable it. A concern for many people that care about privacy is that when you launch the Amazon App Store, you'll be required to sign in with your Amazon account or create an account to use it. So in addition to Microsoft, Amazon will also be collecting your data while using the app. At this time in the Amazon App Store, there are now little more than 1,000 apps. That number is minuscule when compared with the Google Play Store, which currently has more than 3 million apps available. The lack of quantity could be forgiven if the percentage of quality apps was high. Sadly, it's not. For example, if you look at the editor's picks of what are supposed to be the best from the Amazon App Store, you'll likely be disappointed. So is the Amazon App Store any good? At this time with high system requirements and a lack of quality apps most people would want to use, it's not. And until it improves, I can't recommend for most people to install it. Perhaps over time, it'll get better. How could it not? Thanks for watching. Links are in the description. If this video was useful for you, give it a thumbs up and share with others. What do you think of the Amazon App Store? Is it everything you thought it would be? Let us know in the comments. If you're new to our channel, subscribe and ring the bell for the latest on Windows and other tech-related stuff here on Tech Umbo.